There's a big fish trying to eat it. There we, we go. got our subs from Subway. Going to Odyssey Water Sports, 52nd Street. It's the new location. We're gonna rent a pontoon boat for a couple hours and go out. My parents are down here. So we're gonna go have some fun on the bay. It's pretty good. A little cloudy today. Should be about 80 something degrees. We made it out. The new location is behind me. Uh, let's see, there's Mackey's Secrets and it's right there in that channel. They bring you out to the channel. To, there's a red buoy right over here and they'll bring you there. And then he said when we get back, we just call the number and they'll come and pick us up. We're not gonna go down towards the inlet area at all, uh, like Thoroughfare, 50 Bridge, anywhere down there. We'll stay up uh, by the 90 Bridge, this side and the other side, fish here, hang around. We get the four hour rental, so it should be fun. You having fun? Yes. Jumping off the boat? Yeah. He's having fun. He's still in the water. You can touch I'm right there, though, right? Yeah. yeah well, we're not too far from land. It's right there. Nick, you we're, right at, we're right at Isle of Light. Isle of Light Park is there. I can touch. 90 bridges here with all the traffic backed up into Ocean Pines right over there. Mom, so this is our touch. little spot to hang out at. Can you want to go to the island? Yeah. Go ahead. I'll go. Start, start swimming or walking. Kids are gonna walk Dad, to the is there island. Any sharks here? If they are, they're not big. I'm kidding. Watch <laughs> hey, watch out for jellyfish, please. In the, in the, uh, whales. the boys made it. Made it to the island. Wonder if they'll find anything. So there's sometimes there's stuff that washes up over there. Old crab pots and stuff. And of course they find a stick. <laughs> and a dead horse you crab. Here they come, coming back. Where we rented the pontoon boat is, I'm trying to think if you can kind of see it from here. It's pretty much almost straight across. So it's really not far. You guys can still touch bottom, right? Yeah, yeah, let's okay. go. Look. Yeah. Well, was that horseshoe crab alive? No, he was dead. Oh, uh, he died. We found, we found a dead crab. Dead crab? Ooh. Yeah. The pontoon boat comes with the ladder. So number three on the side, if you're in the water, you can see it. We're number three? Out of, he said how many boats are there? Five? Six. Yeah. Six, but one of them was not working, but they have five total. I think, yeah. Dad, didn't the website say it had two? This yeah. one has you yeah. said one originally. No, I said two. They yeah. said they had two. Yeah. And that, but they have five. Five, and then the sixth one's a spare. You can yeah. see the label on the side. It's number three. Number three. Cool. Yeah. How's oh, the water? Is it is it warmer? Yeah. Yes. Get used to it. This first. Help! Come down. said he's going to 360. Go ahead. If I can. Okay, go. I think he made it. Saturday traffic into Ocean City. How much was the pontoon boat? It's four hours. Four hundred for four hours. Plus tax for change. And then you fill out a ton of paperwork. You don't have to have a boater's license. They'll give you a quick course and you get a uh, like a ten day temporary uh, pass. had one. I don't know if he's still on. Yeah, he, he is. Still he is? He's shaking. We're using the, the real JB high-low rigs, the bay ones, the uh, low-vis green with the 2-0 circle hooks. Got him! Bring him all the way in. Bring him in. Bring him in. Keep going. Spot. Second one today. Nice catch. Thanks. William's already got bites. It's been out there a couple couple seconds really not too long at all 
getting a bit again. Go ahead, reel it in. See if we got it. There's a crab pot here and here. I'm trying to get it like right in the middle. And usually they'll kind of hover around the crab pots. One. Number three. He's fished for probably just a couple minutes. We're using squid for bait, the calamari squid. Not that little cup, uh, the little like Sherry Joe's cup, not that. It's the, the calamari in the box. That's the best stuff to use. Cut it up into little pieces and put them on. You can use fish bites too. Those work just as good. Oh, he came off again. Nick caught a ton of fish. Look at all of them. <laughs> Here's the rigs that I used. It was the, uh, the low vis green with the 2 0 circle hook, and then I just got an extra pack of 2 0 circle hooks just in case I bring extra leader in case I have to tie my own. Uh, and I also use just a regular two ounce sinker. Uh, I like the bank sinkers, but I didn't have any, so all I had was this one. I should start eating kind of quick. Yep, there they go. Got a little one. Whoa, someone tried to bite it. I think he just got bit. Oh yeah. There's a big fish trying to eat it. Here we go. Whoa. Here we go. I don't know. Wow. Flounder. He just ate a uh, spot. Bring him around. Open the door up. Uh, I don't know. I gotta check the measurement. Watch out, watch out, watch out. In case it pops, I don't want him shaking the hook. I hate catching flounder on circle hooks. You want me to hold the rod? Can you get uh, my pliers out of that? He's gonna be short. He's not gonna be 16 inches. That's about uh, 11. Yeah. We'll let him go anyway. I'm not gonna keep him today. Oh yeah, wow. fish grip, sir. Thank you very much. They keep. Yeah, they do. I don't have anything to measure them though, Nikki. I do. Just measure them with the rod. We like what uh, DNR doesn't really like when you guess how big they are, but there he is. Nice flounder. Pretty much they, I think I caught a spot and then on the way in, I could feel him chasing it. And then I just kind of let go reeling in and then he, uh, he ate it. Pretty good one. Thanks buddy. Let's see how quick they'll bite. They're biting pretty quick earlier. It's a little spot. That's what it is. Right. Yeah. They're biting now. That's what happened on that flounder. See, I got one on now. I'm gonna reel him in and just go slow and see if another flounder will bite it. You feel the flounder chasing him. Oh. Little spot. This rig is killing him today. You hear him? That's it, we're headed in now. There's a pink house right in front of me with a red buoy. You just gotta watch out for all the jet skiers, but they'll meet you at the buoy and then they'll dock it themselves. So it makes it easy and convenient. That's it, Odyssey Water Sports, 52nd Street. Uh, they get the uh, jet ski rentals and the pontoon boats too. So pretty awesome place, definitely check it out. Here's the phone number for it. Uh, you can go, I think on their website too, odysseywatersports.com. So that's it. Thanks for hanging out with us. Hope you liked it and we'll see you on the next one.